fancy intro. Cha cha cha. Welcome back, everybody. JTX Desert Rad here with another episode of Textcraft. Got to love the Textcraft. Been great so far. It's it's been so fun on the server, and we've got quite a few people involved in it now. We got a few of them online right now. There, we've got Artie, Brimmy, Jesse, Luna, and myself. And there'll be some more on later. But uh, everything's going pretty smooth. If you're wondering where I'm at right now, I'm not sure how I broke down the stream. I had a three-hour stream where I did a lot of stuff, and I'm not sure at this point if it's broke down into episodes or if I just posted the entire stream or what's going to happen. But anyway, here we are with all our stuff over here on the wall, all of our new equipment set up and good to go. And we have this, which nobody has seen yet, which is a chunk loader. Made it and put it over here, and it basically just keeps this chunk loaded because we were having trouble with the refined storage when you would leave the area going offline and having to actually break it and reconnect it. So already figured out if you put the chunk loader on there, we can keep it going full time, and it has been working perfectly so far. Speaking of Mr. Artie, how are you doing today? Oh, not too bad, not too bad. Good Just stuff, good stuff. Getting ready to make the slice and dice. Ooh, slice and dice. He's getting on up there. He is more advanced than I am at this time, so we need to get on the ball and... <laughs> and it's uh, okay to give somebody else a chance every once in a while. <laughs> I need to catch up. I gotta catch up with Artie. Gotta keep up with the Joneses. But, <laughs> one thing I want to do first is I upgraded my I'm not talking about the the jetpack there I upgraded my backpack as you can see here it is now a diamond backpack because we roll like that did a lot of mining in fact let me oops oh you and your mining <laughs> did a lot of mining and went into the deep dark so we've got about a hundred diamonds up there we've got plenty of ores plenty of stuff we had some up here cooking look more iron which iron is always always in short supply so there we go that's cooking now so need this iron gotta get that iron but one thing I do need to see we've got some gold in fact let me go ahead and there put that in the sag mill break down that gold um what was i saying oh one thing i do need to do like quick is if you noticed i'm not wearing any britches well i'm wearing my wrap britches that it came with but i'm not wearing any protective britches so i figure we need to go ahead and invest in a new set of armor i don't want to jump back into iron and all that stuff that we've been using so I figured today we're going to focus on getting some good stuff, some of the good, good armor, which is made using the dark steel. So we have here the dark plate, the dark helm, the dark leggings, and I do want to make a dark pick as well because I love the dark pick. Now to make this, we need dark steel. This dark steel to make it we need iron coal powder and obsidian which we're fine with all of it except the obsidian so I need to go and gather some of that and we will go from there but today turn off that jetpack today is an armor mission so let's go get started on that do I have my yes I have my pick oh wait with the manual and hammer I forgot to mention that Artie upgraded our hammer to a manual and hammer, which was really nice of him. So now we can break um, obsidian. Everything. So I can put my diamond pick in there. We don't need it anymore. We will continue to hold on to our iron pick. In fact, keep it down there. And um, I have that dirt. And uh, we should be good to go with breaking all the obsidian we can with the, the manual and hammer there. I'm excited. I haven't got to use it yet. And I did, if you'll notice, I put a lot 
of lapis on it, which increased it to looting three and fortune three. So that's awesome, awesome, awesome. So we just break our diamonds and whatever with that. And we are good to go. So now I need to find a good open area of obsidian. I forgot about that. I thought this was going to be a long, slow process. But now it's actually going to go fast. It should. It should go pretty quick. If you need more mineral for a pair, let me... Yeah, yeah, we'll do, we'll do. I forgot about that. I do have that manual in there that I should have grabbed. Now, let's see if when we break this, that water is going to keep it all from going bye-bye. I hope it works. I don't know if the water will be fast enough to save all this obsidian, but we'll see. I need obsidian. I definitely need the uh, dark iron chest plate so that I can make the. Uh... But you know, when you have the chest plate, you can't use the jetpack. Oh. Yep, yep, yep. Well, you can keep it on your hotbar. You can just swap them. Yeah, yeah, that's true. So that was eight, so I missed out on one from that. Hmm. That, that, and bam. All right, so now we're producing some dark steel. Um, ah, man, we got to pull our, um, the only thing we're still, yeah, the only thing we're still hurting is them ender pearls. Yep. I have one. Uh, let me see what I have in here. I've got four. Well, that's because you visited my house and killed all my Enderman. Yeah. <laughs> well, we can do a deep dark thing where we build our little shack. Yeah, deep dark is so difficult because the uh, mob strength and all the mobs attack us. Well, that's what I mean. I, I don't know if you remember or not, back when we did, I believe it was the first Artie Craft, the one that I didn't record, we had built a little cage so that the mobs couldn't get to us. The only ones we had to worry about were the baby zombies, but we had it set up where we could still hit their legs and kill them, um, and then we would just pop out, stare at an Enderman, and they would come over by us. Was that in the deep dark? Yeah, that was in the deep dark. I thought it was just in the cave under our house. No, that was deep dark. Well, we did that too. But we had it set up in the deep dark to where all the mobs would try to come in one of those light areas and all the mobs would try to come around. And uh, yeah, it's, it, it wor ended up working pretty good. I think I think that'll be my next project. I'll hop over there and borrow your deep dark thing. Because if I make a deep dark uh, thing over here, it won't go to the same place as yours, will it? I think it should. So like I'm everybody sure. spawns in the same one? I think so. I'm not actually positive. Because generally, it's just the two of us and I always... You know what? I'll make one right quick. Okay. If you need cobble, I have lots. Oh, I, I got I already made it. It's in place, in fact. <laughs> it's made and down. I'd already compressed the cobble and everything, apparently. Okay, well, if you ever need. <laughs> <laughs> All right, here we go. So we have the helm here. Oh, no. Come on. It's going to take me experience. Yeah, that's I forgot one of the about I was that. Thinking about. Uh, especially considering that bug that we ran into, I lost 45 experience. Mm. Well, I, I'm going to be using the jetpack, so I'm just going to have the jetpack, the leggings, and I've already got the boots. So that should be fine for now. The boots are already empowered. 
lucky. So, <laughs> well, all it takes is a basic processor. Or a uh, basic capacitor, I mean. And four levels. Yeah, yeah. And it's not that much, but it's just... <sighs> you and your... Uh, oh no, I need a vibrant crystal. To empower it in the first place. And I just made the slicing dice. So... water didn't pick up oh man yeah yeah <laughs> all right okay <clears throat> so <laughs> i'm putting the dark steel back we're not gonna go with that i'm just oh. gonna make some iron pants you can make a vibrant crystal it's not that well i need to make energetic yeah. alloy I, I, that's I made a bunch for yeah i made a bunch of energetic alloy but i didn't that's what I was doing. Yeah, you can't go vibrant. I've got plenty to make all the energetic alloy I need, but the problem is I don't want to waste my ender pearls on the vibrant crystal. Right, and we don't have an unlimited source of ender. Right, until we can get to the end. Eve. Okay. Well, here we go to the darkest of the deeps. What happened? Oop, lag. It's it might be me. <laughs> All right. And this is going to be horrible for everybody to see. Oh, I got to go back and get more manulin because this hammer is gonna run out I uh -huh. I asked if you needed more no I've, I've got some at, at my house <laughs> I just forgot to bring it with me uh, the difference is uh, for those watching that haven't seen with manulin hammers and, and iron hammers and all that is you saw me mining with that iron hammer and it would be mine a couple of chunks, then stop and uh, repair. Mine a couple of chunks, stop, repair. But with the manual manual and hammer, it lasts a lot longer. I can actually mine much further. And look, that's five ingots right there. This will keep me mining for ages. Yep. So, uh, yeah, there will be no worries there. Yeah, because this one has... 2500 durability versus iron one which has 580 wow and manulin we can we can make fairly easy because now we have the manual and hammer we can go into the nether and use the manual and hammer to mine the resources to make it because I believe it's cobalt and ardite. Ardite, okay. Ardite, yeah. I need what other ore? Do I want this thing to automatically pick up for me? <laughs> it's so handy. Now I can just throw stuff out and <laughs> automatically destroy it. Like, oh, oh yeah. I need, uh, By I the way. Diorite. Artie is talking about what I thought I set up with mine, which I didn't. The filter that I put on my backpack. I accidentally put the wrong one, and it was taking all those ores I listed and storing them in my backpack. So I went back, and I'm trying to create the ore void. Void miner thing. Not void miner. Uh, void filter. So what it'll do is, is destroy like all this extra cobble that I don't need. But I gotta go back and do it, but first I gotta find some either sheep to get some wool or spiders to get some string. Because the wool you can oh. put in the sag mill and turn into string. And it, I have um, about 30 string if you need. 
Oh, nice, nice. Ooh, yeah, I think, I, I think I'm three short. Okay, wool I have. Ah! 58, I have 58 wool. Woo! That was near death. Uh-oh, don't die. I forgot to turn my, um... <laughs> <laughs> my thing on my backpack, my jetpack. Let's just run down here right quick. So nothing can kill us. Alright, we've got plenty of cobble. We're gonna need to clear out an area. Ah! Right, this is gonna be tough. Creeper, blow up. Blow up, Creeper. Oh, I need Ender. Oh, head. witch, poison me. You jerk, witch. Alright, there's just too many mobs there. I'm gonna try to zip on over to another spot. With fewer. Ah! <laughs> Dead, come it! Mm hmm. Oh no, really? I didn't realize I was that close to death. <laughs> Dad, <Okay>. gum it. <laughs> uh, give me just a second here. I'm just making some furnace for Rachel. We need to. It's a vibrant crystal. Then we can do the. No, we can do the night vision potion up. No, no, we can't, can we? We have to do the vibrant crystal first. <laughs> Yeah. The night vision. Yep. Alright, so... Um, what I was saying a while ago is you might want to do the building, and I'll fight the mobs. Oh, gladly. Because I am very slow. Um, yeah, well, uh, what do we... Let me get some... Uh, what do we want to build out? Just cobble? Yeah, cobble's fine. That's the main building material you got, so. Yeah, it kind of is, isn't it? Yeah, so we can just build that. And once we get the building, I mean, then we can make us some slabs and make that little gap so we can swat their legs or whatever. All right, let's, uh, oh, let me heal. All right, let's go, go, go. Ring, ring. Pewing. So what you uh, eating there? Toast. Oh, that, that's what the toast was. It looked like a hot dog to me. <laughs> that's the food of champions. All right, let's uh, drink one of our potions. I'll take my torch back. All right. All right, hang on, let me... Oh, did you already jump down? Of course I did. Okay, I'm, I'm headed down. I mean, I'm slowly going down, but... Where where do you want to build? I'll just let you choose, and once you start, I'll start beating the bad guys back. Right? Um, okay, well... Let's uh, get slightly out of the way of... Mm -hmm. And you know what? Let's try... We should probably just... Oh, you bugger. Hold on. We should probably just make use of this thing. Ah. Ah. I mean, might as well just make use of this. Oh, you know what, Artie? I don't know why I what? didn't think of that before. We can hollow this out. Because all we're yeah. looking for... That's what... Yeah, all we're looking for is to get the Enderman to... Man, I'm an idiot. Because <laughs> we just need to look at them and, and get the Enderman to have a spot over here they can... Right. Hmm. That's that's why Artie gets paid the big bucks. <laughs> <laughs> and then we can just make a little platform out that the Enderman will teleport to, and then we can yep. slap him. Nice. After I died fifty million times. <laughs> All right. Uh. Well, I didn't. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> 
<laughs> Alright, it's done, Tex. Well, we don't even have to go down here. We could do one up high where the creepers and everything can't get to, and only the Enderman can teleport up there that way. No, 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 no! Oh, you! <laughs> like that. You know what I'm Stop saying? Stop putting torches, you stupid thing. So let me oh, see. Oh, you. Like, well, let me use a night vision potion. I probably should have drank that already. Uh. Uh. What, what, what? Ow. I do oh. hate when you put the torches in the uh, second where it thing. Oh, what are you doing, Tex? I'm getting shot. <laughs> well, yes, but I mean, why? Because I'm I'm not very smart. Oops. Okay. Oh, spiders can fit in this one, can't they? Yeah, it's uh. That's why I was saying, um, if we do. Which the spiders, you know, that's that's fine to smack them. But if we do a um just a little Ah Tex, you wanna come into the safe hole over here that I made? Yeah, let me Ugh. Let me finish this. I'm trying to I'm trying to figure out how a good little platform would be for us out here. is actually destroying my sword <laughs> like so ow how'd they hit me oops in all right up here already oh hold on I'm killing a bunch of zombie stuff down here stop it skeleton you're being a jerk man Check yours out, and then you can check mine out. Oh, ah, okay. And then like a uh, one block lip around it for the Enderman to actually land on. Ah, dead gum skeleton. Okay. You know what I mean? So a lip after we stare at them, because we're going to need a hole. Well, first of all, let me put some torches up here. Boop. We're going to need a hole to access so we can fast fly back and drop in here. And the Enderman can't spawn in here, but they can get on that lip on the outside. And we can, we may need to even make that two, two blocks so that we don't lose the Ender Pearls. Yeah, I was going to say, do you want to? Damn it. Why am I so bad at building? <laughs> I've only been Minecrafting for like 70 years. Okay. Alright, so there's that and just in case. And it could be more refined with but we're not looking to make this a permanent thing. We just need to get a few ender pearls. Right. Alright, let's see if we can put that there. And so it's got a hole in the top for us to fly in and out. I'm going to test it. I'm going to fly out and try to stare at one if I can find one. Okay. All right. I'm not even seeing any. Yeah, I... 
Oh, there we go. All I see is a world of creeper. Okay, I got one on the way. <laughs> Do you? Oh. Careful, there's a witch also. I heard him. I don't see him. Is he on top? Oh. <laughs> Sorry, just in case I don't want him to I'm jump down there. Trying to stare at another one over here. There, I'll give you here. Oh, there one is. Yeah, bring it. Okay, yeah. Bring it. Here comes two. Here comes one up here. Ow! Oh, whoa. whoa. Yeah, see? <laughs> Where'd he go? Where'd he go? So we may need to make our little platform bigger. Oh, oh. They're all down on the ground. On the ground. Well, hold on then. Let me try. Let me see something. Ah! Wait a sec. Oh, I ran out of potion. One sec, Tex. Here. Come down here. Where? Down in the hole. Oh, 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 yeah, 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 yeah. Good idea. Nice. And I know you're using your... You can also... Oh, because the ender heads. Yes. Yeah. But it's oh. hard for us both to get near there because it's... Got a zombie head. There's an uh. ender pearl. Did you get it? Uh, no. There's another one. Right, I got one of them. Alright, I got... Oh, I have three now. Nice. Yeah, because you were hitting me with your... Oh, really? <laughs> Sorry. Yeah. Okay, so what I'll do is I'll hurt them. Go hurt some more over here. Okay. Ah. All right, there we go. There's one. All right, you want to come kill it with the ender? Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right, I'll get out of the way. But I don't think, with it not being empowered, I'm not sure if it's going to help us as much. Uh, yeah, yeah, I'm back. I'm going to recharge my stuff. I used like 50% of my jetpack. Oh. Um, and yeah, I have five pearls. Remember, we need 11 to get into the... Well, possibly. It could... Because it's a random number when you get there. It could be completely full. Or it could just need three. Really? I've you, never had it have any in. Yeah, yeah. Oh, they always have some in there for me. I've, I've never seen them with one in there. They've all been empty. Huh. Okay. Well, do you want to go try to find it? Well, I think we should find the end and at least mark it. So that way we know where it's at. And we can count to see how many pearls we need. So we'll know exactly when we can go there. Okay. Well, here, hold on. So that way we don't have to just keep unefficiently mining for ender pearls. All right. Yeah. Let me recharge my backpack. And my... Put my stuff away. Okay. And I am going to... Try to kill a couple of Endermen over here by your place right quick. All right, watch out for creepers. Well, not that close to your place. But... Huh, I was staring at one Enderman and they decided to kill me. Oh, you're fighting him. Okay. <laughs> you're, I see you <laughs> fighting both of them. I was looking at one and it bolted off. Where'd the other one go? Ow! He is just right behind there. you. Oh, no, he's going to kill me. The skeleton. <laughs> 
He killed me under the tree, you bastard! <laughs> All right. Well, on that note, I'm gonna go ahead and end the episode here. We accomplished what we wanted to accomplish. We we got our little Enderman farm going. Um, we did get. I've got five Ender pearls. Artie has has several himself. So we're looking good as far as that goes. Next, what we're gonna do is we're gonna go try to find the location of the end, and then I got that Enderman that killed you. Ah, good stuff. Revenge. And then we're gonna uh, gather more Ender pearls and plan the end trip. So when I come back for the next episode, we should have everything ready and good to go to jump right on into the end and start us an Ender pearl farm. So yeah. That sounds good. Anything you got already? Nope. I don't know how much of a farm we're building, but at least we'll have a source of it. Too much of a farm. Right, right, and right. And we get to test to see if you can see it this time. If we can see what? Oh, yeah. The... <laughs> Last time I couldn't see the par any particles in there, so I couldn't see the dragon's breath. But... So you kept standing in it and hoping you <laughs> gather once you got hurt. <laughs> but all right, everybody take care. And Joseph, Liam, love you guys. We'll see you next time.